one of the toughest brawlers around. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Heart Foundation from Reno, Nevada, weighing in at 281 pounds, Jim the Anvil Nightheart! A multiple time tag team champion, WWE Hall of Famer, and the father of the one and only Natalia. We are about to see something good. is new. This is a match he's craved for quite some time. He's ready and raring to go. see just how focused he is in this one, how prepared and ready he is to take on this challenge. And I do not envy his task tonight. He's got to deal with the Hall of Famer, Jim the Anvil Nightheart. The Anvil likes to say, come hungry and leave no man untested. And it's safe to say that as a former shot... Rolling Nebo! Boot to the face will free him. What are they going to do here? Leg snap! Bang! Measured knee drop. And up the turnbuckles we go. From the top. Whoa! What a landing! From ring post to ring side, risking it all paid off. Facing the anvil is no small task. How do you come away with a win against an athlete as powerful as him? Jim Neidhart is indeed an athlete. But think of his pre-WWE background. Shot put, football. These are sports that required short, concentrated bursts of energy. You need to grind this out and force the anvil to tire out. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by countout. He's got the answer for that one. These two having an answer for everything. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Neck is trapped. Neckbox suplex. Everything's working against Neidhart now. This is it. Good officiating there. Referee seeing him the ropes and breaking the count. Uh-oh, this is going to be nasty. There's the power into the jackhammer. Can the anvil come back from that? Cover. You know, what we're seeing in the ring is about so much more than... And that'll about do it, folks. Here is 
your winner, Bill Goldberg. The loser in this one, Jim Neidhart. The Anvil did not think his night would end up like this. Ladies and gentlemen, when you think of WWE, you think of John Cena. Cena kickstarted the ruthless aggression era and has defined WWE ever since. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds. The WWE Champion! The greatest of all time, John Cena! He has won Royal Rumbles, Elimination Chambers, Money in the Bank matches, and the most WWE title reigns. He's also won the hearts and minds of the WWE Universe. As fickle as the audience can be at times, they know true greatness when they see it. We are witnessing greatness. Here comes Master Gable. And his partner, representing the Alpha Academy from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable! Chad may be the greatest coach of all time. Look what he did to Otis. Yeah, but is Chad Gable actually teaching the right lessons? Look at the record book, Saxton. You see all those Ws? Those look like the right lessons to me. Great tag team partner, great mentor, great single star. Chad Gable has not only resurrected his career, but Otis's as well. And Gable does it all for the Academy. You are looking at the main event. Bray Wyatt has transformed himself and John Cena into the weapons of mass destruction. Guys, this is bizarre. And at a combined weight of 525 pounds, John Cena and Bray Wyatt weapons of mass destruction. We are looking at the hottest team to ever hit Saturday nights. They're not really a team, Corey. I mean, Cena's being brainwashed, I believe. Brainwashed? I think Bray Wyatt makes Cena better. I disagree. 
John Cena is being reduced to his physique and his power. Those are the tools Bray Wyatt needs to dominate WWE. I never thought I'd see the day when John Cena and Bray Wyatt teamed up. But here we are. I still can't believe it. In fact, I'm pretty sure this is just an elaborate mind game that Wyatt is playing on Cena. Oh, that's not just pretty bad. Right, but regardless of how we got here, Cena and Wyatt are quite the imposing team. And of course, we're here in Tampa tonight, where many of today's greats cut their teeth in the sports entertainment industry. And a series of vicious stomps. You gotta wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. Nice running crossbody. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. And that cuts Cena right off. Straight punch, nothing fancy. Now that'll do some serious damage. Tags him in. With a small on their back. Ooh. Oh, counters right into the bread basket. Uh-oh. Able to get out of the way. Whoa-oh, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. Control. Countered it just in time. Springboard stunner by Cena. Placed in the corner. Pinpointing the leg. Oh, clearly had a strategy going on there with the attention on the leg. And what a reversal from Chad Gable. That puts a stop to Gable. Close line. What impact. Had that one scouted. Oh, what's going to happen here? Look out. Oh, an exploder suplex into the cover. Stops the count before it, too. This isn't even close to over. Planning on what to do next. Oh, after that attack on the apron, there is no way we're seeing them leave this arena without medical assistance. Oh. Butterfly suplex. Two. And Cena's able to evade. Disorient your opponent. Caught him right in the jaw. Oh, what a shot. Headlock applying a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. Yeah. Oh, shin breaker. Bray Wyatt comes in off the tag. Bray's feeling a sense of confidence here. 
They are both seeing red right now. This level of hostility is only going to lead to bad, bad things, guys. Every strike more devastating than the last. Shifts the attack into an inverted DDT. Matt slam with some attitude. And sent right into the corner. A counter by Wyatt. There's press! And the piston-like right hands! There's press! Hammer it away! Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. He's got it! Oh, ho, ho. let's get it on! Uh-oh, monkey flip! <laughs> I love it! Seeing right now. No one can. Right on the chops. Heading up. He's thinking back. Able to get there in time. Up high. Wow. Cross body. Oh, man. Drop kick. Compromised position here. No. Someone called a dentist. But effective counter, foot to the face. Hurricane. Oh, boom! Shades of the USSR with a hammer and sickle. John Cena not looking. No, at home after taking that hit. Yeah, as why it's already hard at work melding the mind games with physical attacks. Short clothesline hits its mark. the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. Uh-oh. And Cena finds himself on the receiving end. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, saw it coming. Being carried around with ease. your opponent out of the corner. Cena powering up his opponent into position. Well placed elbow to break up the maneuver. Wicked clothesline. And Cena enduring some very effective offense there. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Drop kick hits hard, lands harder. Cross lead. He may get the three count right here. This is it. Finally, it's over. The weapons of mass destruction, unable to destroy the competition. They say when you know, you know, and I know there's no tag team on the roster that can touch these two guys.
a Lucha Libre megastar now looking to dominate WWE. I'd say there's a very good chance he'll do that. The following contest is a submission match. Making his way to the ring, representing the LWO from Mexico City, Mexico. Weighing in at 200 pounds, Santos Escobar. It is time to pay respect to the boss of the street. Santos Escobar does not play games. Escobar is calm, steady, calculated, and does whatever he has to do to succeed. When Escobar joined WWE, he arrived here under a mask. But he quickly put the past behind him. He evolved. He became the superstar we know today. That change seems like a very good one for Santos. Here comes the lone wolf. Once again, Corbin has redefined himself. Free of nicknames and fancy outfits, here's to separating the men from the boys. You have to respect it. He's at the top of his game right now. His past destroyed, Baron Corbin looks to unleash some pent-up aggression here tonight. I, for one, cannot wait to see it. And we gotta be expecting a cerebral match in this one, guys. This will certainly test these competitors' knowledge of holds, escapes, and counters. It's only tap or nap now for these superstars. And what a maneuver we just saw there. Oh, yeah. oh, wow. Punishing stretch. Damage to the shoulder is definitely going to hamper your ability to fight. Producing a trampling. Oh, he knew what was coming. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Dodged right on cue. Counter after counter. Oh man, what a nasty STO. That offense might have rocked the confidence of Baron. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show out. Elbow drop! Byron, talk about how important it is to be resilient in a match like this. Oh, these are grueling battles. A superstar knows they will be punished and forced to fight through agonizing pain. There's a high probability that your opponent will attempt a submission maneuver many times during the course of this match. And every time it's applied, the pain multiplies. This is not a match for those with a low pain tolerance. And this is just a vulgar display of ruthlessness. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Deconstructing the knee there. Oh, strength of a side of the face. Go for the arm bar and a, oh, there is a fine line between strain and pain when your shoulder is worked like that. Insulting. 
That's going to be a moment you want to forget it very soon. Connecting with a sharp elbow. And that might have shook Escobar to his foundation. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Oh, what a chop. And now tying up the leg. Straight to the knee. Payne must be shooting through that leg now. Oh, the stiff uppercut. Cole does it better. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring inside. You can tell there's pride on the line here. A desire to prove once and for all who is the best. Rivalries like this can be excellent motivators, pushing superstars to new heights or forcing them to take drastic measures to ensure victory. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Whip back into the ring. Oh, what a clubbing blow. He's on his heels a bit now. Things should be at a tipping point here. It's tough to resist tapping out when you're hurting. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Oh, right to the gut. Oh, and a stop. Crushing the knee there. Side set on the top rope. Escobar turns it around. Oh, big knockdown. And another one. This is something else. With the Lariat. Double knees. Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. That's it. Santos just ended things. No way. Astounding power. End of days. Incredible. Escobar's in serious danger. And look at this now. Yes, applying the submission hold. I'm not quite sure if this man. And he very quickly counters. Nice arm drag. Stop you in your tracks. Ah, oh, gets cracked by the overhand. Spinebuster! 99. And Corbin's plans fail there. Uh oh, arm bar. Oh. Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. Escobar. Phantom Rider. Escobar has this wrapped up. Army's grapevine. Trying to step through. Oh. Here comes Tequila Sunrise. Oh, Baron Corbin with a torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Couple of kicks will break it. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Deep six by Corbin. And Corbin just showing off the relentlessness. Oh, he got him. And he's just in reach of the ropes and gets it to force the break. The ropes become a competitor's best friend in desperate moments like that one.
this has been. What a fight. And we are all glad to be witnessing such an extraordinary match tonight. Mounted with punches and not Santos got a pretty good cut from that one, too Connects the fist to the face great counter. Oh my goodness. What an impactful STO Blast off oh, misses the mark Dangerous position with your feet tied up like that. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Big clothesline. Corbin's got him right where he wants him. Uh-oh. End of days. Corbin might take it here. Oh, no. Now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. And you imagine what it would do to him. A single leg. Arm drag takedown. I don't know about you two, but I can barely hear my own thoughts. The WWE Universe is making their feelings heard loud and clear. Delivering nasty stops. Just continuing to dismantle their opponent. And he gets sent back into the ring. Deep six from the lone wolf. Oh no, getting in position. What's he planning to do here? He's got it locked in. He may right now he's looking for any way to break out of this, and he does. There's some power behind that punch. Attacking the arm. Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. And Corbin's laid out. Arm is grapevine. Trying to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise. Oh, Baron Corbin. And watch this. Letting him free. Had him where he wanted him, but maybe he has something better planned. Oh, oh, what a kick! Right to the gut. Kick to the stomach. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Looking to apply an agonizing armbar stretch. Punishing stretch. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Focus in on the shoulder there. And Corbin can't find a way off the blocks. Corbin has been snuffed out. Oh. Right the leg sweep. Nicely done. Kick to the gut. Set up. Canadian destroyer. Corbin fights back. Corbin showing he's not out of it. If Corbin was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Listen to this place. I don't know if this is a good idea. This is going to take more strength than he has left. A lift up. Whoa! with those attacks. Ooh. Oh, oh, man. Taking the 
Rollins outside. This could be good. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. And Santos looks clueless as to where he is right now. No way. Astounding power. End of days. You can't take any more of that. This must be over. Oh, impressive counter. And that might be the start of the momentum swing he needed. Yeah, but Escobar needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. Look at this. Going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Shot lined up. Escobar. Phantom Rider. Escobar has this wrapped up. Escobar on the receiving end. Pinpointing the leg. Punishing the leg. Slam. Oh boy, he's stalking him. Watching for an opening. Thanks for coming. Corbin with the end of days. Amazingly executed once more. He avoids the damage. Has the arm into a hammerlock since then. Armbreaker. Ah. Ouch. Kick to the gut creates separation. He's turning the tables. Escobar. That's it, Santos just ended things. And Corbin may have felt that coming. Boom, boot! Nice. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Catches Santos. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Oh, targeting the stomach. Oof. Come on! No one likes a count out. Looking to apply an agonizing armbar stretch. Oh. Getting clubbed by the axe handle. Forcefully isolating that shoulder there. Ooh, what a nasty kick. Insulting. And Corbin with a counter. Thanks for coming. The end of days. One more time throwing the heavy artillery. Oh, and soon we could be seeing a submission here. Nice escape. Just insulting. Yeah. 
and he stonewalls Corbin. Kick to the midsection. Setting them up. Canadian Destroyer! On his grapevine, trying to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise! Oh, Baron Corbin. Oh, the torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Couple of kicks will break it. Punch right in the head. Oh, look at it. It's on now. Shots being fired right now. Neither competitor letting up. Each exchange just sapping the energy from these two. You can feel the contact, and so does the WWE Universe. Oh, ouch. Boom. What impressive determination from both competitors. Keeping at each other no matter what. Picture perfect drop kick. Lifts their opponent's oh, legs. Oh, 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 that's a free fall. Ooh, what a nasty kick. Oh, insulting. I see a cut, too, on Corbin after that. Tossed into the corner. thinking about what to do next here. Oh, right to the throat. Oof. Uh-oh. At the days. Vehement force from Corbin. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. Campbell clutches in. Look at the torque. Oh, no. Nice escape. Corbin strike hits the mark. Heavy-duty blow. Oh, disabling the leg with that. Corbin perched up top. Oh, look out. Elbow drop. Santos was ready there. Oh, the big boot. Smothering offense now from Corbin. This has become all Corbin. You can feel the contempt as Corbin delivered that move. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with this hole. It's not in and he very quickly counters. He reverses it. Oh, Santos counters. And that's what we call the tree of woe position, folks. Ah, he's got that boot right up against oh, his face. Come on. Baron Corbin in a daze. It could be the end for him. Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. And it can be all over for Corbin. Arm is grapevine. Trying to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise. Oh, Baron Corbin. Well, the torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Couple of kicks will break it. <laughs> Shot punch. Corbin's got him right where he wants him. Uh-oh. The end of days. But I think that finally closes the book. Placed in the corner now. Oh, set. Escobar. Phantom driver. Exclamation delivered by Escobar. Arm is grapevine. Trying to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise. Oh, Baron Corbin. Mm. And he lets him out of the submission hold. Could have been a strategic move to wear down that body part for something bigger later. Vertical suplex. Ooh. Oh, 
just scrubbing the face on the canvas. And an elbow drop for added measure. He is looking to do some serious harm. Able to get the advantage here. He ran to the midsection. Setting them up for the Falcon Arrow. Big elbow. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. No way. Astounding power. End of days. Unloading their best shot once more. Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. And he very quickly counters. Boom. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. Escobar. Phantom driver. That's it. Santos just ended things. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. The arm bar is locked in. Ah, oh, Baron Corbin. Fujiwara. Oh, nice way to get out. Corbin gets stymied. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Uncorked a big punch. Whoa! Close line. Boom! Makes him pay with a counter. Into the ring again. With authority. Just stretching out the arm. This is a unique application of a hammerlock. Oh. A warning and a challenge from Escobar. Oh, elbow caught him right on the bridge of the nose. And Corbin may have felt that coming. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyperextend your elbow. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. He's got it locked in. It's locked in. And he very quickly counters. Oh, look at this. Oh, Mix. Oh, man. Good grief. Turn your lights out. This is aggressive attacks. Deep arm drag. Looking to take flight here. Perched up top. Look out for him. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Thanks for coming. End of days. I don't care who you are. You can't survive any more of those. Baron taking a step back and measuring his opponent. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. He turns it around on Corbin. One, 
He climbs into the ring. The confidence. Saving us from having to sit through that. Ooh. Ooh. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Block the effort and cut them off with a shot to the gut. Oh! Look at this, just unloading. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. He'll take things into the ring. Baron Corbin can put it up. Oh, hold on. Is he thinking of the submission here? Look at the torque. There's no escape from the camel clutch. Give up now. A single leg camel clutch and a great no. counter. Deep six by Corbin. Oh. Hits him with the counter. Lighten up the chest, and now straight to the knee. Santos falling victim to an onrush net. Uh-oh. End of days. That's got to do it. That's got to be it. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. I have no idea. And he very quickly counters. Oh, my goodness. What an impactful STO. That's it, Santos just ended things. And what he's looking for here looks like a potential submission maneuver coming. A painful looking Fuji what? Great escape from the arm bar. Oh, close line. Attacking the knee. Down to bonus and a double axe handle smash. An attack on the knee. Great reaction from Santos. Keeping him in position. Here it comes. Big splash in the corner. Thanks for coming. End of days. That has got to be the one. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. Right now he's looking for any way to break out of this, and he does. Considerable damage, though. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. So much torque on the knee and ankle. Dropping the elbow. Oh, and targeting the knee. Kick to the gut, set up, there's the Canadian Destroyer, wow. Arm is grapevine, trying to step through, uh -oh. here it comes, Tequila Sunrod. 
Well, the torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Couple of kicks will break it. Attack from Escobar. Blend that loop. Watch out. Whoa, look out. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Oh, right to the kidneys. God. Ooh, he saw it coming. Baron just adding salt to the wound right now. for coming in the days. What an exclamation mark right there. Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. A single leg camel catch and a great oh. counter. Right to the kidneys from behind. Back suplex, no. Driven down. Down to Odin. And a double axe handle smash. Uh oh, uh oh. So hard into the ring post. Worried look on the face of Escobar. Yeah, Santos has worked into it. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm, has the arm trapped. Goodness gracious. from the Lone Wolf. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. Oh, body is not meant to bet. And he very quickly counters. Placed into the corner. Uh-oh. Escobar on the receiving end. No way. Astounding power. Corbin with the end of days. Pack it up. Corbin's got this. Locked in after nice escape. Escobar each one keeps getting more devastating. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Trapped in the arm bar and escaping the Fujiwara arm bar. Thanks for coming. End of days. Incredible. Corbin's wrapped this one up. Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. Uh, he's in complete control. A, a single leg camel catch and a great oh, no. counter. Great strength being shown here. Oh, face first. Isolating their opponent's arm and oh. Goodness gracious. the opponent's head like a basketball. <laughs> Uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. <laughs> Bang! Drop kick. And Santos is getting the crowd going. Ah, oh, look at this. Headbutt! Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Boom! What a right! He's one step ahead there. He went right into that turnbuckle. Kick gets caught. Close line takes him down. Forget about it. Oh, Santos counters. Oh. 
Both men now on the apron. This is a scary situation. Are you kidding me? Off the apron to the floor. Really just laying it in. Look at this. Just. to the midsection. Setting them up for the Falcon Arrow. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. No way. Astounding power. End of days. So much brutality with that move tonight. Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. All right, this one's over. Tap out coming. Nice escape. Sent into the corner. Knees are crook. Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. Exclamation delivered by Escobar. Arm is grapevine. Trying to step through. Oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise. Oh, Baron Cook. Well, oh, the torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Kicks will break it. Big boot. Climbing up top. He's got big play. Incoming. Moved at the right time. Debilitating attack on the leg. Has the arm into a hammerlock since then. Arnbreaker. He skirts around it. Escobar able to dodge that. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Escobar. That's got to end it this time around. Oh, hold on. Is he thinking of a submission here? The armbar is in. Great escape from the armbar. Oh, no. Now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. And he very quickly counters. 
Pierce. Up and oh, spiked with a Frankensteiner. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Caught with a clothesline. Uh-oh, jump! That might be enough. Yes, it is. Clothesline. Oh, kick right to the gut. Taking the wind out with a stomp to the solar plexus. Stumps. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. Escobar. Phantom Ryder. That's it. Santos just ended things. Oh, no. Getting in position. What's he planning to do here? Fujiwara style ligaments are about to and escaping the Fujiwara armbar. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Targeting the throat there. Escape just in time. Uh oh. What are they gonna do here? How about a little? Oh, the gory special submission locked in. And you trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. He got whipped into that corner. Connects with the Meteora! With authority. The better part of Valor. And he's taking this to the outside now. Power bomb! Uh-oh. Escobar turns it around. Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. Thrown back in under the ropes. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Gavin Gary. Wow. He's back into the ring. He eludes. Uh oh. After days. How much more can they endure? Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Oh, body is not. A single leg camel touch and a great oh. counter. Uh oh. Uh oh. Corbin avoid. Uh oh. What are they going to do here? How about a little? That's exactly what they were thinking. Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. <laughs> Saw that one coming. Escobar. Phantom Ryder. Escobar has this wrapped up. Arm is great, Vine. Trying to step through. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise. After everything, these two men have. Oh, the torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Couple of kicks will break it. Kick to the midsection. Setting them up. Flipping pile driver. Spiked. And Escobar didn't see that coming. Uh oh. The end of days. Well, that proved to be enough this time. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? Oh, no, this is not where he wants to be. Yeah, but can he run? A single leg camel touch and a great oh, no. counter. Kick to the midsection. Could be thinking about the gory special, yes. Oh, the gory special submission locked in. Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. Nice 
escape. And corks it, uppercut. Drop kick to the face. There he goes, right into the corner. He turns it around. Thanks for coming. End of days. Pack it up. Corbin's got this. Great trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? Camel clutch and sitting deep into it. All right now he's looking for any way to break out of this, and he does. Oh, elbow caught him right on the bridge of the nose. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Oh, that's gonna sting your back. Oh. Ooh, what a nasty kick. Just disrespectful. Again, will it produce dividends? Arm is great by trying to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise. Oh, uh, Baron Corp. Well, the torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Couple of kicks will break it. Rack. No, a neck breaker. And didn't see that boot coming. Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. Exclamation do And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with this hole. Arm trapped in a submission. Ah, uh, he's in complete control. Fujiwara, oh, nice way to get out. Deep six by Corbin. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Hands locked under the chin, and this camel... And he very quickly counters. Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. This one has to be over. And look at this now, yes, applying the submission hold. It's the arm bar putting a ton of force on the shoulder right now. Great escape from the arm bar. Able to avoid any harm there. Oh, man. Bam! And Corbin with a counter. Uh-oh. How's that for a counter? Enough already. No way. Astounding power. End of days. Baron Corbin can put it away here. And what he's looking for here looks like a potential submission maneuver. And he very quickly counters. now from the top rope missile drop kick on point uh oh what are they gonna do here how about a little goalie special oh baron corbin trying to find a way out elbow into an arm drag beautiful escape Plans fail there. Ooh, what a 
nasty kick. Insulting. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Boom! What a right gosh. Great wherewithal on the counter. Hurricanrana. Oh, that's just insulting. Escobar is picking the competition apart. Santos is showing no mercy out here. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Corbin able to reverse. Corbin finally creates some more offense for himself. Corbin isn't allowing that burst of attacks to put an end to him. Kick to the midsection. Setting them up. Kane, destroyer! Arm is great by him. Trying to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise. I think he's got it locked in. Good. Oh, the torque on the knee. Rolling through now. Couple of kicks will break it. Ooh, clothesline delivered. Oh, a nasty. And this one might be headed ringside. Deep six from the Lone Wolf. Taking this one back to the ring now. <laughs> if this works, it could change the course of the match. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. From way up. Good Lord. Taking flight. Big. The daredevil in you comes out when you... Big <laughs> risks like that. Who rocked him with that kick? Three. <laughs> Escobar connecting with the Phantom Driver. That one has to end this. Driven into the barricade. Oh, he slammed his face right into the barricade. Climbs back inside. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. Yes, able to survive and pull through. Here is your winner, Santos Escobar. And with the ref's count, this match has ended. The winner looks a bit let down that this is the way the match ended. Perhaps they should have tried to break the count at the end there.
<laughs> Just a different feeling in the air when WWE's resident superhero makes his entrance. The following contest is an extreme rules match. Making his way to the ring from Las Vegas, Nevada. Weighing in at 190 pounds, Ricochet! Well, up to this point, Ricochet has seen plenty of success here in WWE. Won titles with his unbelievable agility. It's like Ricochet found the options menu for life and turned off the gravity option. Yeah, no camera tricks, no hidden wires. Ricochet, he's the real deal. of Lucha Libre tonight. He's ready to show his skills without Legato tonight. Whether he's representing a family or standing alone, you must respect Cruz Del Toro. A ton of potential finally coming to light with his hardened attitude. Extreme rules are now in effect in this one. Anything goes from here on out. That's right, Cole. If these superstars can dream it, they are absolutely free to do it. There's nothing standing in the way of their most ambitious and sadistic imaginings. There he goes, right into the corner. I able to counter. Connecting with the moonsault. A running Hurricane Rana. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn things around in a hurry. Oh, looking for a backslide. Oh, my! Into a drop. Standing shooting star press. It's incredible the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Oh, what a knee. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Looking for something, anything under the ring. back on Cruz. Oh, God, that hurt. Corey, what's your best shot at winning in a no disqualification match? You lean into the stipulation and leave no stone unturned. Use everything at your disposal to get the win. Otherwise, what's the point? Point of the elbow, nailed it. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. I can already feel the sting of the kendo stick, and I do not care for it. Kendo stick to the skull. Now he's been put on the defensive. That's a real showcase of Del Toro's talent. Oh, into the barricade. Oh, hello. On the outside. Back, suplex onto the barricade. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Oh, merciless looking blow. Driving a knee into the arm. Athleticism from Ricochet. Just a relentless series of strikes. Oh! 
double axe handle. He's looking a little weary now. The stupendous speed and power of Ricochet is yet to run out of steam. I don't know what they're looking for here. About to introduce some metal into the mayhem in the form of the trash can. And now thrown back into the ring. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. He's thinking a steel chair is just what he needs to wreak some havoc here. Wow, what a drop kick. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. An interesting rivalry brewing between these competitors as of late. It has become a true game of one-upsmanship, with neither side backing down. A part of me thinks things will definitely get worse before they get better, guys. He steers clear of contact. And he heads out of the ring. No countouts, no worries. Lands an elbow. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. Looks like he knows that he who laughs last is the one with the sledgehammer. Ricochet with a moving target. And there was some force on that move. Oh, tossed hard into the ring post. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. And Ricochet getting completely grounded there. You ask for extreme, you get extreme. Though this looks like a little more than was bargained for. We got like John Henry swinging the hammer like that. Steer clear of that. And he tosses him back in now. Not going to win this match, setting it up there. Slingshot cross body, what a move. Risking it all and able to connect like a homing missile. Oh, from behind. Oh, wow. Frankensteiner. Nice. Del Toro hooks the leg. Fisherman driver. Del Toro putting all those tools to good use. Really making the most of his opportunity. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Holy meet the barricade. Crucifix head scissor. We might be close to the end. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. Ricochet living to fight another day. Amazing resilience from Ricochet. That was plan A, and it didn't work. He must be thinking about plan B at this point. He's looking to take this fight to a whole new level. These men have been He can end it here. He's got him. Man, that was such a long and hard-fought match. He earned that victory. Here is your winner, Cruz Del Toro. Cruz Del Toro comes away with the win. Ricochet couldn't duck and dodge his way out of losing. And tonight, the highlights were at his expense.
The D'Angelo family is here in business. Very good. Tony and Stax take what they want. The only problem is they want it all. The D'Angelo family surveying the scene, ready to make their move. Well, I have a feeling the opposition is going to be sleeping on the mat real soon. Better than sleeping with the fishes. The damn Dudleys at it again. Oh, baby, we are about to get extreme. Bubba, Devon, such incredible communication and continuity. It's hard to believe they're only half brothers. Yeah, the Dudleys have been beating up folks for decades, and they're still going strong. And that is what's up! Uh, Bubba! Bubba, Devon! Oh, we're quiet. Did you guys quiet. Did you guys hear that? Shut up, Corey! Don't ever do that again. Oh, you're such a snitch. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 472 pounds, Tony D'Angelo and Channing Stax Lorenzo, the D. And their opponents at a combined weight of 595 pounds. The WWE Tag Team Champions, Bubba Ray and Devon, the Dudley Boys. Here we go, gentlemen. The tag team titles are up for grabs. Final preparations between partners before the action begins. Here we go with one of the most malicious and innovative tag teams the WWE has ever seen. The Dudley Boys, a team synonymous with finding new and creative uses for furniture inside the ring. The Dudley Boys are all about causing chaos and destruction at the price of their opponent's well-being, and often their own, too. It's certainly not a style of competition that suits everyone, but for the Dudleys, risk-taking just comes naturally. Yeah, but they've got to deal with the seedy underbelly in the D'Angelo family. While Stax and Tony might live by a certain code of silence, they certainly do a lot of talking in the ring. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Getting him into the corner. Oh, uncorked a big punch. Quick thinking pays off. Oh, driving the elbow. He gets tagged in. Sit right back. Tag. Oh, body. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? No, shoulders up at two. 
That was a long two count there. Uncorked a big punch. What a counter by Tony. Getting set up for something in the corner. Tag is registered. Right to the kidneys from behind. Did you see that? Propelled through the air. And tag. He's in now. Finally. Took him out at the knee. Just doing anything they can to chip away at the base. Skin. There was no issue with that attack. Hey, sometimes desperate times call for desperate measures. Who are we to judge? There's the takedown. Devon now lacking any signs of resistance. Devon's getting exposed. And a big right hand. Ah, look at this. Oh, that can dislocate something. Oh, foot just stomping down. Here's a pin for the title. The champ avoiding a one count. It is going to take a lot more to keep him down. Kick to the gut. Fist to the skull. Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. He needs to find an escape prop. Nice. to the face will create separation. Now Stax looking for some momentum. This could be a good chance for Stax to get some distance and rethink things. His match is, of course, just another entry into what has developed into a feud of historic proportions. Few superstars have ever loathed each other like these competitors do. It goes beyond competition, beyond normal emotions. And the resulting matches have always been utterly spectacular to watch because of it. Oh, man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. into that turnbuckle. Oh, he might eat out of a straw after that one. Close line in the corner! Oh, this is just torturous. Yeah, the death lock applied. Oh, man. Just tap out. This is agonizing. The death lock is in. Something's about to go either very wrong or very wrong. From the top. Elbow drop. Good Lord. More offense like that, and we could be looking at a new champ. Uh-oh. Dax gets countered. The adrenaline is pumping. Tag made. The Dudley boy setting it up. is why they're the champ. Placing them into the corner. Boom! What a right! Boom! Headlock applied and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. He skirts away, living to fight another day. Oh, this here is vintage. Snake eyes. Drunk him. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. This has got to hurt. Headlock applied and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. Some hard offense landing on the champ. Yeah. For the championship! Kicks out. That is 
is just pure instinct at this point. He got whipped into that corner. Great counter. He switches it back around. Uh oh. Oh, and Stax fights back. Uncorked a big. champion makes the cover uh -huh. teammate makes the save and just in time so much punishment has been absorbed by these men already and yet they are still going still ready for more shoulders down championship on the line What a moment! Here are your winners in the new WWE Tag Team Champions! Tony D'Angelo and Channing Stax Lorenzo, the D'Angelo family! A winning effort tonight from the D'Angelo family. Let this be a lesson to the whole WWE. The D'Angelo family is an organization that is not to be taken lightly. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Women's Championship. A great young talent with an extremely bright future. One of the biggest names in women's wrestling before joining WWE, trained by Booker T. You can't judge her by the company she keeps, but she is definitely living up to her hype. You can see the passion for competition in Roxanne's eyes. The very definition of young and hungry. One of the greatest women to ever step in the ring, Natalia. One of the most experienced superstars in WWE. She has accomplished nearly everything you can here. And there are no signs that Natalia is slowing down by any means. She mastered the sharpshooter in the heart dungeon, and she's looking to unleash it tonight. Natalia's got tremendous power and aggression. He 
Introducing the challenger from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Natalia! And her opponent from Laredo, Texas, the NXT Women's Champion, Roxanne. Social media is buzzing, as it always is, when this title is defended. One of the brightest young talents in all of WWE, Roxanne Perez, is set for action here. Roxanne has already accomplished so much in her young career, it's hard to imagine where she'll be in just a few short years. One thing's for sure, I don't think anything or anyone can stand in her way. She's definitely proven she's up for any challenge. I'm sure tonight will be no different. But unfortunately for her, she's facing Natalya, the Queen of Hearts. If there's any such thing as a grizzled vet in the women's division, I'd have to say it's Natty. I'd imagine she'd take issue with you calling her grizzled, Saxton, but I get your badly worded point. This is the woman who helped train Ronda Rousey for WWE. Few people know this sport like she does, and as a result, that makes her very, very... Here's the pin. Title on the line. Stops the ref count before two. Clearly, she's still got a lot of fight left in her. She was clearly waiting for that. Ooh, dropped right on their face. And into the count. Gets the shoulder up after one there. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Turning the tables there. What a face buster. Roxanne Perez has proven herself to be quite the competitor, Corey. Her impressive resilience has to make her a tough opponent to figure out. There's certainly no fear when it comes to Perez, but I think that's what makes her so unpredictable. But Cole, it's also that lack of caution that can be dangerous for Perez. Looking wobbly in the corner. Running hip attack. What impact. Roxanne just can't seem to stop this offense. Yeah, Perez clearly got a bit reckless, and her opponent's really making her pay for it. Boot to the gut will stop anyone in their tracks. Effective arm drag. Oh, here it comes. Big takedown right there. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Whoa, round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. Quick side step by Natalia. His path. Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Expected that one. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Perez fought tough on that one. Oh, man. Reversal. Can she capitalize? Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Bash straight into the post on the outside. She heads out, but this one can be lost by count out. Check your face after that one. Point of the elbow finds the mark. Sky high monkey flip. And she gets herself out of a precarious position. Right hand. Practically never-ending blows coming at full force here. Natalia turns the tables. Put her in a position now. Power bomb into the post and to the floor. I felt the vibration of that one from all the way over here. Ooh. Oh man, meeting the barricade.
And guys, she's dangerously close to a count-out loss. Face first off the barricade. Gut-wrench suplex. Delivered into the barricade. And she slides her back to the mat. Roxanne Perez. Griff pop rocks. Another one bites the dust to the champ. Kick out. Still has hope. This puts the pressure back on the champion. Can the champion respond with their back against the wall? There's got to be some sense of desperation right now. She's used her best weapon, but the match still continues. A bad place to be for the challenger. Here we go. It's popping off. So much pride, so much resiliency on display. Two titans trading strikes and refusing to back down. Ooh. Toe-to-toe, -to -toe, treating each other like heavy bags. They are emptying their tanks, going back and forth. Roxanne Perez looking for Griff Pop Rocks. But champions need to finish the job. And that champ stands tall once again. Here is your winner, and still the NXT Women's Champion, Roxanne Perez. So she succeeds in defending her title tonight. She's not losing this title that easily. She's got her sights set on a long reign. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. It is for the NXT UK Championship. Just admit it, every one of us has a price. Well, we all know DiBiase's money doesn't jiggle jiggle, it folds. We've seen thousands of dollars folded in the mouths of fallen opponents. Well, perhaps we can expect more money to be donated here tonight. The Million Dollar Man is used to getting his way, and those who oppose him will pay dearly. Yeah, DiBiase just doesn't want to win. He wants to bankrupt his opponents. It's... Fight 
Three men born and bred to throw down. Ridge, Holland, Sheamus, Butch, three men bonded by their love for fighting. Yeah, you could say that again, Cole. These three will fight anyone in the locker room, anyone in the street. Heck, they'll fight each other if they have to. Hey, no matter who fights who, there's one guarantee. It'll be fun to watch. The brawling brutes are about to show us all how they earned that name. Ladies and gentlemen, fight night is officially underway. Introducing the challenger from Palm Beach, Florida, weighing in at 260 pounds, the million dollar man, Ted DiBiase. And his opponent from Birmingham, England, weighing in at 200. And five pounds, the NXT UK Champion, Bart! And there it is, the NXT United Kingdom title. This is what it's all about. These men want to etch their names in the history books. Want to be one of the prestigious few to hold the United Kingdom Championship. How did scouted? Into the corner. This can't be good. Headlock. Oh, a cheap shot right above the eye. Oh, oh there's a submission on the way. It's in. And the rope forces the break. Great effort, though. What now? Oh, not to the belly. Oh, oh there's a submission on the way. It's in. Figure four leg lock. Oh, look at this. He's trying to turn it. He does. Turns the pressure. Jarring headbutt. Uh-oh. Stopped dead in their tracks with a shot to the face. Ducks under. Let's go behind. Instead, what a German suplex. That kick will stop you in your tracks. Now, oh, trampling the opposition. Uh-oh, there's a submission on the way. It's in. Figure four leg lock. Oh, look at He's trying to turn it. He does. Turns the pressure. Close line. Off with their head. DiBiase felt that coming. I can't imagine what is going through your head when you're facing off against an opponent as unhinged as Butch. Well, if you're not careful, it'll be Butch's fist that goes through your head. You can't out brawl him. And trying to match his intensity will run your tank dry in a hurry. I'd say try to frustrate him. See if he'll make mistakes now that he wouldn't in the past. Vicious knee. Whoa! How is this superstar still in this match? Hard determination. This is your time to shine. Oh, what a close line. Has the challenger pinned? Is this it? Just kicks out. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? Butch! 
Oh, this is interesting. Butch with the X-Plex. Goes into the pin. Two count kicks out. He still has life. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. DiBiase wards that attack off. Reversal on top of reversal. Sequence of reversals there. This is making me nervous. Oh, on the apron! The challenger not looking good right now. At this stage of the match, they are clearly starting to feel the effects of this back and forth. Avoiding contact. Big clothesline. Both arms captured, and vitriolic stops. The stomp in every single part of his body. Right out of ringside and back to the mat. Oh no, this isn't gonna end well. Double stomp to the legs. DiBiase felt that coming. DiBiase was scouted there. He had it scouted. Scoop slam. Setting up in the middle. Here it comes. Ouch. Carefully placed elbow. Cover. Two. They have a brand new champion fulfilling their destiny. Here is your winner in the new NXT UK Champion. The Millie. can't believe it. There you see our new champion. The now former champion obviously not happy with this outcome. I did not think a title change was in the cards here tonight. The Viper, ready to strike. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from St. Louis, Missouri. Weighing in at 275 pounds. The Viper. This may sound hard to believe, gentlemen, but I think Orton might have actually loosened up a little recently. It's more of a relaxed confidence. Randy Orton knows he's at the top of the game. Yeah, but let's not forget, Randy Orton can still go to that dark place when he has to. And you don't want Orton going old school on you. Well, Randy Orton has made a career out of psychologically dissecting his opponents. And many of the victims who have fallen for the Viper's schemes stay down for good.
Always composed, always in control. No one is more calculated. Once legend killer, now possibly the greatest legend in WWE history. With eyes full of wrath and fury, here comes Ilya Dragunov. And his opponent from Moscow, Russia, weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya Dragunov. There are not many superstars more ferocious than Ilya Dragunov. Well, that ferocity, Saxton, has led Dragunov to the NXT UK <laughs> Championship. Let's see if it brings him more success tonight. Well, this man will need some sort of answer from Randy Orton's quick strike attacks or else this match will not last long. Ilya Dragunov ready to bring his aggressive style to his opponent here tonight. Dragunov has to be one of the toughest competitors in WWE. Few can match his intense and relentless approach to competition. I don't know how he manages it, but Ilya Dragunov always seems to be on the attack, even when being attacked. Certainly a dangerous competitor for anyone who's... And here's a cover. And that'll be a rope break right there. Pulled in from belly to belly. Dragunov has said to himself, and I quote, I am violence, and he considers himself to be invincible. How do you account for a man like that? Well, if anything, he's too intense. Dragunov puts too much emotion out there, and sometimes that rage gets the better of him. When he goes fully off the handle, that's your opening to exploit his mistakes. But it's going to hurt to get to that point, so be ready. So ruthless. Devastating elbow. And perhaps that size disadvantage coming into play there as Dragunov is put on the defensive. Orton looked confident in that exchange. He can do it here. Just after two. He got close there. It could be do or die time. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. No respect at all with that action. But it can also be meant to antagonize. Could be a method of luring your opponent into a mistake. Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Uh-oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. He's returning fire. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Exploit that. 
And he was ready for Orton. And he is finally able to mount some resistance with that. Time for Dragunov to get his energy up and claw back into the fight. And he sends him into the corner. Dear, this doesn't look good. Ouch! That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. He is doing whatever possible to torture the knee. And an elbow. Cover, cover! No, he kicks out. It'll take more than that to hold him down. Dangerous stop right to the face. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Can't prepare your feet. Thinks he has it. And Randy Orton is your winner. Here is your winner, the Viper. Elia Dragunov defeated here tonight. The Viper had his eyes on the prize, and he struck when the time was right. Of course things ended his way. The following champion versus champion contest is an extreme rules match. It is for the NXT North American Championship. Mr. Two Titles has arrived. Right now, he has never been more confident nor more proud. This is an accomplishment on a different level. Well, just think of the road he traveled and what he endured to be here tonight, holding two championships. Well, it has to be recognized that right now, we are witnessing dominance on another level. Facing a man in the Miz who knows how to win, it will take any opportunity to capitalize. Well, I'd say this is anything but awesome. He's spoken like a true jealous Z-lister, Saxton. You're not even allowed on this side of the velvet rope.
already such a, a WWE and Hollywood success. But the thing about Miz is he always wants more. Yeah, and the Miz will stoop to any level to get more. It works, doesn't it? Miz can do it all. Movies, reality TV, even game shows. Yeah, the only thing he can't do is actually shut up. Maybe you should teach him how, Saxton. Why would you silence an A-lister? Byron's never been on any list. Introducing the challenger from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 205 pounds, the WWE United States Champion and the WWE Intercontinental Champion. Here we go. This is what it's all about. The NXT North American Championship is on the line. We've seen the NXT North American title in the middle of some of the fiercest matches on the black and gold brand. And for good reason, Michael. The North American Championship puts your name on a short list of champions. It also puts a huge target on your back. Snap suplex. Set up in the corner of the ring. And that was a well-executed attack. A uh, big hide on that moonsault. And he's taking this to the outside now. Grabbing a kendo stick. Any connection with flesh will definitely leave a welt. Just like that, Paul finds a counter. Saw that one coming, took advantage. In trouble here. And, oh, what a great counter. That'll break it up. And he stonewalls Logan. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Paint a picture for me, Corey. Hypothetically, what are some tactics you'd use to win an ODQ match? Well, I'd stash some kendo sticks beforehand. Maybe have a buddy waiting to give me a much-needed hand. Maybe throw Saxton like a fastball special. That's the beauty of a no-disqualification match. You can do all that and not get dinged. The sky is the limit. Boom! Right to the body. The champ now absorbing a little damage. Yeah, as that was yet another sign that Logan Paul is a quick study when it comes to this business. Going for a pin for the championship. A kick out to stay alive. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. Suplex, so here it comes. Nicely done. Equalizer in hand, and he is just goading his opponent to make the first move. Miz with awesome awareness. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Ouch. Here it comes! Side effect! Uh. 
This one is headed outside, guys. Way to steer clear. Swinging the elbow to halt the offense. Oh! He's able to sidestep there. Boom! Head first. He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. I don't care what they say, nothing good ever comes from getting the tables. Saw it coming and got out of there. The social media megastar with a suplex, but Logan Paul not done just yet. Blatant disrespect. And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? Barely thinking a steel chair is what's needed right about now. Oh. 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 And he's able to reverse. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. display of stamina. The champ showing they're truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. And that didn't prove to be the proverbial one lucky shot from Logan, but we know he won't. With a championship on the line! Yes, got it! New champion! Here is your Becoming champ like this, he is never... The following champion versus champion contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the NXT Women's Championship. A true submission expert, the Queen of Spades. One of my favorite superstars in the world today. I'm 100% with you on that one, Cole. A menacing look in her eye. Michael, I think you mean terrifying? Baszler is ready to subdue any and all opposition she encounters. Baszler just absolutely loves combat in any form. You say that like it's a bad thing. All hail, 
The Queen. Charlotte's already a legend because this is a what have you done for me lately business and the queen never rests on her laurels, never spends any more time than needed celebrating the history she's made. Charlotte is constantly moving forward to become the greatest superstar sports entertainment has ever known. A very tough test tonight, stepping into the ring with a technical wizard in Shayna Baszler. You can see it in everyone's eyes. They all want this championship. The Queen of Spades, Shayna Baszler, ready to compete and ready to break some more competition. It doesn't get more intimidating than Shayna Baszler, guys. She's made perfectly clear she's tired of waiting for opportunities and is instead going to make them for herself. And the way she plans to do that is by inflicting as much violence as humanly possible. And as Baszler has proven plenty of times before, she's capable of a lot of violence. But Charlotte Flair is no easy task, and she will tell you that herself. And she'll back it up to Saxton because the Queen is anything but all talk. The epitome of athleticism, power, speed, and poise. All with a little flair on top. Down for a European arm breaker. Charlotte a step ahead there. Into the corner now. She manages to get control. Big impact off the neck breaker. This is why it's good to have a manager. It's good to have an ally who wants you to win as badly as you do and will introduce any tool to produce victory. How do you compete against an opponent whose in-ring game is as complete as Charlotte Flair's? You have to get the queen off her game. So I target the pace. Don't allow Charlotte to control the tempo whatsoever. If you're able to do that, she'll be off her rhythm and some cracks might start to show. It's not over yet. Plenty left to go in this one. Good timing with that reversal. Hooked up. Now oh, look at the power. Side slam. Baszler turns it around. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Counters on top of counters. Natural selection. Hard to fight off that move from the genetically superior Charlotte Flair. Drop kick. Beautiful. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Charlotte's still in this. She just shocked everyone in the ring. Oh, I missed you. I wanted to knee you in the face again. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. She's 
sent flying into the corner. Completely vulnerable atop the turnbuckles. Uh-oh, going up top. This isn't going to be good. Countering the queen. She's fighting back. Ah, oh, setting them up. Going to hoist them up high. All the way up and all the way down. Fall away slam. A nice kip up. Enable the counter. Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. Plenty of harsh words have been exchanged behind the scenes leading up to this match. Now they can finally get down to business. But all that jawing's half the fun, if you ask me. And a well-placed insult can help get inside a rival's head. So ruthless. is the move into a DDT. Brought down with a neck breaker. No. Cross body. Whoa. Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. Whoa. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. The floor, the barricades, our table, none of the... Ooh, refusing to let her get into her head. Heard that she did not come here to play games. Uh oh, new champion! Forces the shoulder up after two. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. Oh, Charlotte Flair steps through. Here we go, figure eight. Look at this, she releases the hold. That's a little surprising, no? And that one misses the mark. She did her homework there. Flawless takedown. Ooh, man. Well measured. Just rubbing salt in the wound now. The Queen now going up. Flying. Oh, that's it. What a splash. That's got to be it. Two. And a new champion is officially crowned. Here is your winner in the new NXT Women. for our now former champion. I thought the defending champion had this well in hand, but the new champ had other plans. It just goes.
The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 478 pounds. The team of Sammy Zayn and Kevin Owens. A duo that always delivers when it comes to tag team action and the WWE Universe is ready for it. Oh boy, look who's here. The Phenom has arrived. And demise awaits anyone who stands across the ring from the dead man. The Reaper walks among us. And their opponents first from Death Valley, weighing in at 299 the WWE Champion, The Undertaker! Oh, yeah! The magnificence of the Phenom. Truly a mesmerizing scene. The legendary Phenom creates an atmosphere unlike anything you will see. Talk to anyone who's ever been in the ring opposite The Undertaker, and they will tell you nothing prepares you for this. The stoic walk of the dead man. Three decades of dominance. The dead man's wrath is unending. An unspeakable reign of terror over the WWE. And this is the moment where there is no turning back for The Undertaker's opponent. Welcome to damnation. Shane O'Mac is in the building. And from New York City, weighing in at 235 pounds, Shane McMahon. He has made an in-ring career out of doing things a man with his upbringing usually doesn't do. He clearly has a few screws loose, but it's paid off for him. He's literally the best in the world. Superstars in their respective corners now for this tag team match. All set for action in this one, we have Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens. Then the opposing team is of course filled with Undertaker. And Shane McMahon. This match can very well come down to experience. And I'm not just talking about individual experience. I'm talking about the experience you have with your partner. Knowing how to be on the same page is going to be crucial. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. DDT. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. And he cuts bait, slipping out of the ring. Shut up, Saxton. This is just a small regrouping. Left by the turnbuckles. Boot right in the jaw. And I don't think there was anything necessary about that. Down on her DDT. He thinks he has it. Oh my, how in the world did he 
kick out of that. Loose cover leads to a strong kick out. Undertaker's been disarmed. DDT! Is it enough? Oh, somehow! Just using the adrenaline to stay in the match. We're no closer to a winner just yet. Drop kick right on point. That menacing nature of Taker challenged a bit there. Yeah, Zayn put a little extra oomph into that one. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. That one busted up Undertaker. Here we go! Oh, God, that, that, that's a bad landing! Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. Drops the leg! Oh, what a right! Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Shifts it back onto him. Quick exchange of counters there. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Yes, tag! He needs to fight his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. And an elbow. Oh, kick right to the gut! Shot. Oh, this, this superstar using the rope as a weapon. This is uncalled for. If a shortcut presents itself, you better take it. That was just wrong. You should be a better person than that. Yeah. Big forearm. And Owen's able to reverse it. Oh, and back of the elbow. Tagged with a punch. Missing the pin. No, he punched the shoulder before three. And frustration might be starting to set in. Oh, a big uppercut. Oh, caught on the chin. Absolute hatred boiling over in this one. This continues to be personal, not just professional. You're right, Cole. Sure, either side would love to beat the other in competition, but this is more about beating them down physically and mentally. Any time, any place. Damn the consequences. Time to go for a ride. Exploder! And he goes for the pin. And a kick out at two. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. And that was an effective attack, guys. And off the tag is Sami Zayn. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. You've solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. Lands the knee. Cinching in a waist lock, but right hands. Manages to fight out with a series of punches. Seized it and waves off the pin. Comes in off the tag. Vicious right forearm. Attacking the body. Sense of confidence here. Sammy Zayn, take down. The coach is up. How's he going to get out of this predicament? Elbows his way out. Oh. 
Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. Counters! Sami Zayn looking for it. Blue Thunder Bomb. Is it up? The cover. Two. Almost ended it there. So, so close. That could have been it. Reaches his partner for the tag. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Great. Uh-oh. Stop. This could put a stop to The Undertaker. Look at He saw that one coming. Gar scraping over the eyes. How much longer can these superstars continue to fend off defeat? Every obstacle's been met with equal measures of tenacity. It's gonna take a lot to close this one out. Oh, he retaliates. Impact. Shane O'Mac wards that off. A big kick to the gut and a clubbing forearm. What's going to happen here? Backbreaker. That attack made it look like Owens might have picked too big of a fight. Yeah, as Shane O'Mac is giving it his all. Shoulder. Big drop of the leg. And he's got him by the... Uh-oh. Elbow throw saying not today. Ooh. We're at a vital stage in this matchup, and this audience is fully aware of it. Yeah, they know another turning point can come at any second, and that can be the instant that ends it all. Sami Zayn tags in. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, look at his aggression in the corner. Yeah, on the throat in the corner. Oh, dear. This doesn't look good. Alley-oop! Delivers the leg drop. And Sammy taking it back after that offense. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Check. From the center of the ring now, up top spring ball, DDT! Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. That was playing with fire and getting burned. The decision to take such a risk at this juncture is questionable. Implanted by the DDT. Oh, tossed hard into the ring post. Four. Five. Gets the tag. Last second knee to the face there. The referee continues the count, may call it soon. 
Precarious position for both superstars. Oh, gosh. Back suplex on the apron. He may be in a bad way here. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. Leg drop across the throat. And he gets set back into the ring. No, no, no. Oh, God. An absolutely foolhardy decision made there. That could be very costly. Don't know if the risk was worth it. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Hoisted up, double underhook. Weaves out, and a close line counter. Listen to this crowd. What a feeling. And these superstars are feeling it too. Kevin Owens is in the zone and letting the opposition know it. He's testing fate here in danger of a countout. Driven down with a sidewalk slam. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Using the elbow as a weapon. And that's a lot of blood starting to pour from Owens' head. This superstar's got the grip! Choke slam! I'm telling you right now, this could be at the feet off. Hell's Gate is locked. Got it. There's the winners of the tag match. and Shane McMahon. An incredibly impressive showing by this tag team. Tag team excellence in its purest form. You simply love to see it. And I hope we see these guys tagging again real soon.
And here come three women looking to take control. Perhaps the most dominant women's faction in WWE history. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring. Representing Damage Control from San Jose, California. Bailey! Three women who make each other better. Multiple tag team title reigns for Dakota and Io, and countless main events for Bailey. No doubting that, but they've been taking shortcuts to get to the top of the women's division. Yeah, and here's the sad part, Michael. They don't have to take all those shortcuts. Well, you're actually right about that, Saxton. I agree, but shortcuts are what will get them to the top sooner rather than later. Well, I hope for her sake she's psychologically prepared. Bliss is a master of mind games and manipulation. Alexa Bliss is here. One of the most accomplished competitors in the women's division. And from Columbus, Ohio, Alexa Bliss. She's held the SmackDown, Raw, and women's tag titles on multiple occasions each. The second woman in WWE history to win the women's triple crown. We are seconds away from another moment of bliss. Blissful for us, not for her opponent. Two of the most decorated WWE superstars, Alexa Bliss and Bailey, have met many times in unique situations, but the superstars they are today are completely different competitors. Bliss and Bailey have forged their own paths. These two women are constantly evolving, which makes them very unpredictable. And now that you say that, it is hard to imagine what Alexa will do next these days. Always unpredictable, always devious, and truthfully, I can say the same about Bailey. She is just desperately trying to fight out of it. Monster set up in the corner. Ouch. Punch right to the. F Sent to the outside. Here she comes. Drop kick finds the mark. She's beginning to flag a little. Good golly, what a knee. Driven down face first. Three. Delivering nasty stops. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. And Bailey never saw that coming. And now gets tossed into the ring. Russian leg sweep. Shoulder tackle. This is Alexa's playground now. She has made that very clear. She has indeed, Corey. And frankly, I don't know if Bailey has what it takes to defeat her anymore. Can she do it here? She kicks out with authority after two. Just barely, but it counts. To the jaw. And Bliss effectively rocked by some well timed offense there. Smart offense from Bailey as this makes the cover. She gets a quick kick out there. She's still in this one. Both arms captured and vitriolic stops. 
And one more for good measure. And repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. Off into the pin. There's two. Oh, barely kicks out. She just won't stay down. This feud is starting to become one of those that will go down in history. Flashes like this are what puts names in the Hall of Fame, Cole. I'm just glad we get to watch it firsthand. Alexa Bliss, DDT, does Bliss finish the job here? Two, almost had her, but she gets the shoulder up. Would you look at this, she is removing the turnbuckle pad now. What an interception, spectacular counter into a dragon screw. Kick to the lower back. Boom! Insult to injury. Insult to injury. Alexa Bliss, top turnbuckle. From the top. Are you kidding me? You can see the rage in Alexa boiling right now. Bailey getting more pain than play from Alexa. Oh, straight forearm. Staved up that attack. Back elbow. See, did you see that? Placed into the corner. Ooh, man, what a hit. Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. Followed by the stop. Alexa Bliss has taken out a lot of damage. I'm not sure. Hoping to end it here. This is it. She kicks out with force. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. <laughs> oh, that's gonna sting. These two trading one blow after another. Boom! Just teeing off with that fight for everybody. Neither competitor is backing down. Boom! Two fighters putting their haymakers on autopilot right now. Both absolutely drained, but both refusing to give up. Exhaustion setting in, and neither one of them is letting up. WWE Universe appreciating these athletes going all out. Basement drop kick. Alexa Bliss with a little... Alexa Bliss with insult to injury. Bliss only had sinister intentions with that move. Definitely more pain than play there. Bailey and Bliss have spared no effort in trying to best one another tonight. She's looking for the win. Kick out. She just will not go away. A quick reversal by Bailey. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Bailey looking to end this one. This might do it if it connects. Rose plant by Bailey. Alexa's chances are dwindling. Two. And that'll do it. It's finally over. Here is your winner, Bailey. Bailey went to another level tonight. She dug deep into her arsenal and clearly showed a little Miss Bliss something she was not expecting.
The following contest is a submission match and is for the NXT Championship. Listen to this frenzy for L.A. Knight. If any dummies out there don't know, now they know. L.A. Knight will hand out a beatdown to anybody, any night of the week. It doesn't matter to him. There's no doubt LA Knight has created something special with the WWE Universe. It's a real movement with everybody saying his name. Now it becomes about what can Knight do with it. Here comes the double champion. I can't imagine the amount of pressure he's feeling carrying around two championships. Yeah, the pressure is on when you have one title, but with two, it has to be immense. He's looking pretty unshakable entering the ring. Yeah, and whether he is or not, just appearing that way to your challenger is what it takes. And the champion knows that. Introducing the challenger from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 241 pounds, L.A. Knight! And his opponent from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the You can see it in the eyes of each individual. Only razor sharp focus when this much is on the line. The bell rings on the submission match, and guys, you don't see one of these every day. A very unusual match for a very unusual kind of competitor. You can only win this match by making your opponent submit. Neckbreaker. Measured up nicely. Fist drop. Denied via a wicked punch to the stomach. And he 
saw that coming from Knight. Taking off from the ropes. Sharp knee. He's got him scouted. Boom, hit the button. Delivers the knee drop. Great defense by Knight. Saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Oh, what a power slam. The champ trying to roll with these hits. Unhinged offense from LA Knight's arsenal. Corey, what's the best defense going into a submission match? As with most sports, the best defense is a good offense. Having awareness of your opponent's limbs at all times and weakening them will also make their submissions less effective. Oh, Cody anticipated that. Oh, man, he is fired up now. Able to evade. Get to the gut. And a big right hand. Tossed back into the mat. Cody Rhodes has him set up. The crossroads. The champ will stay champ. Oh no, getting in position. What's he planning to do here? Impressive this. Oh man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. He's burying elbows in the midsection. From the second rope. Sunset flip! Wow. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Uh-oh. Way too long. To the arm, hyper extend your elbow. The challenger not looking good right now. Submission matches are all about grinding down your opponent, and that is what we've been seeing all this time. Cody Rhodes hooks him up, nails the crossroads. Can it be? Will the rain continue? And look at this now bad intentions coming with this hole. Exhibiting a crazy amount of strength here. Gil oh man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snap there. Striking with the knee drop. So precise. Springboard off. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Rhodes from the middle row. He just barely dodges. Breaker. Knight might be looking to fly. He has a right where he wants him. From the top, double axe handle connects. One step ahead of Knight there. Single leg takedown of their opponent, and there it is. It's time to go to school with the figure four leg lock. Look at this, he let it go. Curious decision there, Michael. Bam! Gets him with the counter. Now a series of vicious to respect these men for taking it to the next level. This one's becoming too close to call. Yeah, it's hard to predict how this one will end. Rhodes turns it around. Knight moves out of the way. What a boot.
Good defense. Oh, nice bulldog. Cody. There's Crossroads. The champ has this one in hand now. Oh, no. He can be caught here. Bad spot for him. Just wrenching away. Can you imagine what it would do to his... Oh, man. That was a thing of beauty. Right into a snap there. Vicious right forearm. LA Knight kicked to the gut. Blood force trauma. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Has their opponent down. Camel Clutch locked in. Agonizing submission hold. Camel Clutch. Great way to break it. Figure four leg lock applied. It's cinched in. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. in this capacity crowd is on their feet. And with good reason. These superstars are earning all of their respect. Great counter. Impressive ring IQ on display there. Using the ropes. Punch lands. Looking as confident as... Uh-oh! Knight caught by surprise. Whoa. Inverted suplex. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. Whoa. No! Suicide dive! Pinpoint precision right on target. He's able to counter. LA Knight kick to the gut. BFT. The title might change hands. Two. This arena is roaring. I think the desk is shaking. Three. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. One up. Uh oh. But right hands create separation and an escape. There's the bulldog. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. And Knight clearly ready for a fight here. the stomach to reverse that maneuver. Cody Rhodes has his opponent right where he wants him for crossroads. Looks like the champ is going to retain. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. Working that hold now. It's not embarrassing to tap. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snap mare. Cody manages the counter. Both competitors showing how well they know. LA Knight kick to the gut. BFT. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Has their opponent down, and the camel clutch is cinched in. Now Cody Rhodes trying to hang in, but I think Cody. Camel clutch applied. They're not going to last long here. Wait, wait, wait. The grip is broken. Oh, uh, caught him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No way. No way. Pedigree by Rhodes. Cody looking as dangerous as he is dashing. Rhodes about to head to the pay window. Trash Rhodes. I think the champ's got it. 
Uh oh, he could be looking for a submission here. Really working that. Submission locked in tight, nowhere to go. Oh man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Oh, he dropped. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. What a close line. Headed to the top rope. Taking a break before coming down like thunder. What a match. It's total madness in here. And he gets delivered back into the ring. to the floor now. And L.A. Knight wants more from his opponent. Whoa. L.A. Knight, blood force trouble. Gonna see a new champ. Oh. 
He fends off the attack. Lariat. From a seated position, this takes tremendous power. Into a suplex of their own. Rose gets out of dodge. Punch connects. And he sends him to the corner. It's a big hit. Cody retaliates. That'll turn your lights out. Cody looking to wrap this one up. Cody looking to end this. This could do it. Crossroads. The title's going nowhere. Way trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? Can they get the grip locked in? Tap out. Do it now. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Oh. Strikes with a kick. Going up top. Big forearm. Punch. Was ready for that. Down with the bulldog. Incredible reversal into a DDT. He's going for it all. From the top. What? Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Rolling into a monkey flip. So much damage inflicted. Well, oh, that'll weaken your arm. These superstars are showing no concern for their own well-being. All that matters to them right now is doing as much damage to one another as possible. A pedigree! Six. Cody is feeling a rush of confidence right now. Eight. He L.A. Knight kicked to the cut. L.A. Knight with the B.F.T. Uh -oh. And he saw that coming from Knight. Picking the leg. Oh, we got to see it. There it is. Figure four leg lock. I'm not trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. He takes control. Using the ropes. And Cody Rhodes reverses. One springboard attack. Target is set on LA. He's in peril. Rhodes has his opponent. Looking to put his opponent on Dream Street. Crossroads. Wait a minute. Setting in. Devastating submission coming. In trouble in the grasp. An extreme amount of. Oh man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Vicious right forearm. Fought back with a punch to the gut. Oh, a springboard roundhouse. 
Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. Oh, had it scattered and met with a back elbow. A counter answered by another counter. Big blow could be felt throughout the arena. Good God, that's devastating. Hung across the top rope. Cody looking to attack from above. From the top. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. Good grief. That's a chop that'll wake you up. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Fires back with a crucial elbow. the rope. He's positioning himself. Closing in. Cody Rhodes has him set up. Crossroads. A championship level move. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? Unmitigated demonstration of power. Oh, this one's up. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snap mare. Question for you guys, whose game is it? The Megastar Elbow. Uh-oh, Camel Clutch locked in, agonizing submission hold. Oh my good, Camel Clutch. Great way to break it. First, a knife edge chop, and now continuing the attack on the knee. Oh. Straight to the knee. Oh, caught him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No way. No way. Pedigree by Rhodes. Submission maneuver. Just wearing down the opponent. Ah, uh, he's incomplete. Oh man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. <laughs> he has an answer for Rose. Reversal after reversal. Proving Cody Rose has an opponent right where he wants him. Nails the crossroads. The champ has this one in hand now. Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. Oh, my God. Superhuman power. I think he's got it locked. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Stalking their opponent. What are they going to do here? Oh, knee Ooh. right to the face. The close line. He manages to escape. L.A. Knight with B. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Uh-oh. Oh, right in there. Has it hooked in. Inverted vertical suplex. This is just establishing dominance, followed by a stomp. Uh-oh, uh-oh, no way, no way! A pedigree! Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Wow, the power that takes is insane. Uh, oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Drops the knee. Oh boy, ready to strike, guys. What are we gonna see? Big time knee, Lariat combo. Up across the shoulders, here we go. Rhodes denies the attack. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. 
Cody looking to end this. Crossroads by Cody. I think the champ's got it. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Outright presentation of power there. Oh, body is not meant to bend that. Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Power slam! A knee drop! Climbing up to the top now. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. From the top, fighting back by the counter. the solar plexus. Don't do it! Suicide dive! Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Pedigree yeah. by Rhodes! Oh, they back up. They're, they're getting too close for comfort. Oh, no one's paying attention to you, Saxon. They're too busy beating the tar out of each other. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Heading up, he's thinking big. From the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. I think we know what's coming next. Caught by the back of the elbow. LA Knight kick to the gut. BFT from Knight. We can have a new champion. Uh-oh. He catches Knight with a counter. Down he goes. Rolls about to head to the pay window. Crossroads. Looks like the champ is going to retain. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with his hole. Remarkable power being shown here. He's got it locked in. He may not have a choice. In oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Ready to a snap. Cody has him up. Drives them down with a vertebraker. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. Oh, the elbow drop to the knee. Oh, look at this. Really softening up the leg. Extreme hard placed upon the left knee. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Knight doesn't have any room to recover. L.A. has run into a roadblock. Oh, my goodness. Just strike it at will. My ah, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. Foot to the midsection. This their opponent's oh, legs. Oh, oh. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. High rent district for Cody Rhodes. From the top. Elbow drop. Good lord. All the momentum has swung to Cody Rhodes. Cody's getting that unstoppable look in his eyes. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming from the top rope. Oh, he knew what was coming. Knight managing to get some control back now. Brief sign of adrenaline from L.A. Down. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him, Michael.
He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. And he slides him back to the mat. Brutal boot. Oh, man. Goodness. Counters into a brutal... Cody Rhodes has him set up. Crossroads. But champions need to finish the job. Submission here. It's locked in now. I have no idea how he has intent. Oh man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Rose tied that one. What a clothesline! Ouch. Oh. Whoa! Drop kick all the way to the outside. He's got him in the crosshairs. From way up. Whoa! What a landing! No matter who you are, when you crashed on the floor, a searing pain races through your body. Wards off that offense from Cody. Thanks, uh -oh. Uh -oh. Able to parry that one. Side effect. He's got him scouted. He gets back into the ring. A show of confidence from Knight. Got to find a way back into the ring now. Before the count runs out. We could have been looking at a count out there. Cody Rhodes hooks it up. For Crossroads. Can it be? Will the rain continue? And look at this now. Yes, applying the submission hold. Uh-oh, in the crutches. What a unique submission maneuver here. Look at the pain as a... Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. L.A. Knight BFT. The champ's eyes look glazed over. As their opponent down. Camel Clutch locked in, agonizing submission hold. Uh, Camel Clutch. Great way to break it. The American Nightmare. There's Crossroads. Now that is why they're the champ. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? And now latching on. Uh, body is not meant to... Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. He must have had that scouted. Big boot! Cody retaliates! Uh-oh, uh-oh! That's a free fall! Springboard up! Tossed with ease! Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Cody Rhodes gonna fly over the Cody Cutter. Oh no, now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. Oh my god, superhuman power. I think he's got it locked. Oh man, that was a thing of beauty, right into a snapmare. Answering back. What is Cody Rhodes looking for here? Oh my! Vertebraker. breaker! I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. He's lining him up! From the top rope! Beautiful drop kick! Uh-oh! He finds a counter for Rhodes. Stop. Ah, uh, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. 
Oh, weakening the leg here. He gets him with the counter. Sequence of reversals here. Both superstars clearly studied game tape ahead of time. Rhodes denies the attack. Delivers the knee. His end is near. Cody yeah. Connor, what a move! Oh, hold on. Is he thinking of the submission here? Putting the pressure on now. I have no idea how he hasn't tapped out yet. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snap. Scales all the way up to the top. Look out! Catches nothing but air. Set up in the corner of the ring. And it's a long way down from there. Setting them up. It's about to get worse. Watch this athleticism all the way to the top, my God. And down we go. Cody Rhodes felt that coming with the lariat. Up to the top rope now. Launching. Just broken something. Incredible pressure being put on Rhodes. Cody Rhodes has to try. LA Knight. LA Knight with the BFT. We can have a new champion. Evades the attack. With the reversal. He's able to take a stand there. Cody isn't allowing that burst of attacks to put an end to him. Russian leg sweep. of L.A. Knight not even considering taking this seriously. Running knee! Knight has become relentless. Knight has his opponent figured out. And back elbow creates separation. L.A. Knight, blood force trauma! Gonna see a new champ! Break someone's back and make them humble. Camel clutch. Great way to break it. Yeah. Cody looking for the win, and this could do it. Crossroads. The champ will stay champ. Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. Impressive display of power. Submission locked in tight. Nowhere to go. No escape. This... Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Vicious right forearm. He's been placed in the corner now. And he saw that coming from Knight. Loving blow. Dear, this doesn't look good. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Oh, elbow caught him right on the bridge of the nose. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. He foiled that attempt. Oh, caught him in the head. 
Inverted atomic drop. Ooh. Ooh. Devastating knee to the neck. Knight in a state of distress. Knight is going to have to dig down deep. Well, he's about to head to the pay window. Crossroads by Cody. The champ has this one in hand now. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. Putting that strain on him. He's got it locked in. It's locked in. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Ready to a snapmare. Oh, boy, ready to strike, guys. What are we going to see? The close line. Taking this to the floor. Ooh, saw it coming and hit him with a shot to the face. Hang it back with their own counter. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. Drops an elbow. in under the ropes. A calculating look has come across Knight's face. LA Knight kick to the gut. BFT. The title might change hands. Uh-oh. And he makes it to the ropes. I knew he could. Uh-oh. Camel Clutch gets to the ropes and that's going to cause the ref to break the hold. Cody Rhodes with his opponent. Third breaker. And the knee. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. Cody Rhodes has him set up. The crossroads. Now that is why they're the champ. Wait a minute. Setting in. Devastating submission coming. Looking to apply pressure. It's not in bed. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Ready to a snapmare. Makes him pay with a counter. Shot to the gut will break things up. Hellacious power slam. And Cody Rhodes reverses. Uh, off the rope. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. to interrupt. L.A. Knight kick to the gut. L.A. Knight with the B.F.T. Uh-oh. He catches Knight with a counter. Goodness, inverted suplex. Those mounted with punches. And, not, and a Oof. stomp to the gut, too. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Cody Rhodes with a through the air. Cody Cutter. Oh, no. He can be caught here. Bad spot for him. Exhibiting. Strike. Oh man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. He's going for it all. A little. Vicious right forearm. Put into the corner now. He turns it around. No! Suicide dive! Unbelievable athleticism. Just going for it all and landing a direct hit. Rose has his opponent. Looking to put his opponent on Dream Street. Crossroads. Rhodes 
showing his opponent how confident he is. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. Resiliency to win this one. Here is your winner, and still the NXT Champion, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. And they were not able to beat the ref's count. This one ends in a count out. Not the win they wanted, but it's a win nonetheless. Oh, yippee, it's Chelsea and Piper. Be careful, Brian. They have the general manager on speed dial. Green and Niven possess a continuity that borders the unorthodox, but when they focus on the same target, they get the job done. Yeah, they're united by their desire to rule the women's division at any cost and make the entire WWE universe miserable. Piper Niven, Chelsea Green, ready to put the women's division on notice. An amazing blend of physical dominance and top-level trash talk. Piper and Chelsea can't be stopped. Caden Carter and Katana Chance, the Warriors of NXT. They love to have fun, but they are all business inside the ring. Yeah. You know, Carter and Chance were a team long before NXT even had a women's tag team division. And it's paid off because this team is the team to beat in all of WWE. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall. And it's for the NXT Women's Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers, the team of Piper Niven and Chelsea Green. And their opponents, the team of in Kaden Carter. Some tough 
tag teams in the NXT Women's Division all clamoring for this title. Katana Chance and Caden Carter, two superstars who refuse to let their diminutive stature define them. In fact, they even consider their size an asset. Yeah, for as small as they are, they more than make up for that with their athleticism and unorthodox offensive style. Chance and Carter's in-ring dynamic really is unmatched. They can do things in the ring we've never even seen before. And they are facing the surprising duo of Chelsea Green and Piper Niven. Surprising? Don't you know who that is, Brian? That's Chelsea Green and Piper Niven, one of the most dominant tag teams in the history of WWE. The only thing surprising is they allowed you to observe them. Brian. It's Byron. She catches Katana with a counter. Reversal from Katana. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Ooh, she just turned it around. Oh, man. Kick. The challenger's looking shaken. You can tell Katana was zeroed in on her opponent. And a suplex. Here's the pin title on the line. Champ with the shoulder up. We'll see if this is the start of a rally. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. You can see the intent behind that attack. Exploiting the arm must be the strategy here. Taking out the knee. Well timed and well placed by the champion. It'll be tough to put weight on that leg now. What a hurricanrana. That maneuver goes to show you how much speed kills. Placed in the corner. Kick. Oh. when endless strikes are being rained down on you. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Counters right back on Chelsea. Wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. Drop kick to the back. Never saw it coming. As this rivalry has grown more and more intense, reason has gone right out the window. That happens when a feud is allowed to fester like this one has. Yeah, there's no telling what we might see tonight. There's just so much rage and resentment in the ring. Face for a turnbuckle. Uh oh. Counters. This could be an opportunity. Great move! She needs to get out of here in a hurry. Places her right in the corner. Suck in the trio low. No escape in sight. Tagged in. 
She's pumping herself up, reaching out for that burst of energy. Big form. Impressive reversal there. Oh, that can flatten you. Going for a pin for the championship. And a kick out. She is still fighting, still keeping this going. Picking up speed off the rope. Oh, a hip drop to the gut. She's able to get the tag. Look the skin of her teeth. Oh, another lights. Ooh, what a forearm club. Looking worse for wear. Giving a massive effort to overcome the pin attempt. She fights Piper back. Carter able to stop the blitz that was coming her way. If Carter was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. Then she'll make the tag. In the wheelbarrow, nice counter. Wow. Uh-oh. There's the backbreaker. Right across the chest. Picking up speed off the rope. The champ getting put to the test here. Yeah, as Piper Niven was channeling that ruthless aggression, just dominating the competition there. Got dropped to oh, base first. Thinking from Piper. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. Ooh! It's their opponent's oh, legs. Oh. That's a free fall. There's a tag. Just turn that around. Oh, put down face first. Oh, buster. That is it. She gets the tag. So precise with the super kick. No way. Slingshot cross body? That was ridiculous. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Ah, oh, the body's not meant to be stretched that way. Right to the leg. Oh, that backfired on him. Six. She sent back in under the ropes. The challenger's hopes are the champion into the cover. Oh, I thought the champ had it. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Bionic elbow driven down. And Piper is failing to offer any resistance here. Carter isn't holding anything back. Down to Odin. And a double axe handle smash. Careful. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. She bails in a hurry. And set right into the corner. And Caden was scouted there. Nice cross body. Gets the tag. Catching a drop kick. 
And that will be a blow to Chelsea's confidence. Carter's tenacity worked in her favor. Kicks the leg of their opponent, steps through. Here we go. Rolling death lock. Rolling death lock. Looks like she has other plans here. I think she was just looking to soften her up a little there. Here's the pin to retain. Breaks the count. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Tag made. Tandem offense incoming. Set off the ropes. Trip, drop kick, and the exclamation point. Topea Tomiko. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Bullseye with the drop kick. Looking for a high risk, high reward situation. Yes, tag. There's a tag. Uh oh, jawbreaker! Call the dentist. She's pushed into the corner. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Hoist their opponent up. Uh oh. Great awareness as she proves to be too quick. The hammerlock, flatliner. And they're still in this. Ooh. You can just see how much winning this match means to these women. They are absolutely going above and beyond to put each other away. When you're in an atmosphere like this, when you can't hear yourself think because the crowd's so loud, you find a way to do superhuman things. That's what these combatants are doing here. Sent hard to the outside. This superstar picking up speed. Quick thinking from Piper. Got the leg and drops the elbow. Katana was expecting that. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. And now she delivers her back into the ring. Flipping sent on attack. And Niven going hard on the offense again. No matter the cost, Niven is continuing to be an aggressor here. She just won't stay down. Oh, kick connects. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. In off the tag. Scissors. Lands the massive corkscrew splash. And Chelsea taking a heavy dose of damage tonight. Yeah, Chelsea's getting pulled into some treacherous waters here. Specifically targeting the leg. There's a the crucifix. Nicely done. Two counts. Stay put. Here are your winners. And still, the NXT Women's Tag Team Champions. The team of Quintana Chase in Kaden Carter. And a big time victory for this tag team here tonight. Two minds working as one in the ring to create magic. It is a beautiful thing to witness, gentlemen.